what are the two or three main hormones? The main hormones that you think of when women talk about their hormones uh -huh. are estrogen and progesterone. So estrogen and progesterone. What does yes. the estrogen do for a lady? Well, estrogen has many effects and um, it's estrogen is actually a class of hormones and there are several actually three that are produced in a woman's body so you can't just say estrogens they, that's you've got right a lot. it's a little more complex than that but from the patient standpoint mm -hmm. what does an estrogen do for that patient from a sta patient standpoint the primary role of estrogen is to um, cause ovarian function now the ovarian function what's mm -hmm. that mean um, ovarian, the, the ovarian tissue is what a woman um, has that develops and ovulates, produces an egg each month. So the primary function of these hormones during the reproductive years are to allow a woman to become pregnant. Ah, so does the estrogen do anything to her uh, skin or personality? Well, it does. There are actually estrogen receptors throughout the body. So estrogen has effects on the brain, on mental function. Do I need some estrogen? <laughs> <laughs> well, you have some actually, uh, small amount. <laughs> ah, that's right. Does the brain work better with estrogen hormones? Well, we know that it plays a role in mental function, <laughs> but it's confusing as to what that role is actually, and which yes. stages of life. And what else does it do for a lady to make her pretty? Well, it has effects on the skin. Uh -huh. What kind of effect? It affects the collagen makeup or uh -huh. the elasticity of the skin. So it makes the skin smoother and makes it the does. lady prettier that way. Would that be you correct? You could think of it that way, yes. Uh, any other main purposes? Uh, well, for it plays a role, if you think about it, puberty, in making a girl appear more like a woman. So it plays a key role in breast development, in menstrual function, so starting to have periods. Uh, so it really, so it, kicks in. Is there much estrogen when somebody's two, three, four, five? There's not. There's not much estrogen at all. And um, the estrogen production kind of keys up around the age of puberty. And it's not a, puberty's not a one-time event. It's kind of a process over several years mm -hmm. that kind of transforms a girl into a woman. Well, let's get, let's talk about that time because mm -hmm. estrogen then uh, will increase breast development, helps the menstrual cycle in its body. What's the other main hormone? You said progesterone. progesterone. What does it do? It also plays a key role in these areas, and it plays a role um, in the development of a healthy egg and in the development of a normal menstrual function as well. Now, the normal menstrual function, mm -hmm. what does it do to the uterus? Well, the estrogen, you could think of, stimulates the uterus uh -huh. to develop tissue so that if a woman becomes pregnant, there's a healthy environment for her to maintain that pregnancy. Progesterone counteracts that activity. It either supports a pregnancy as it starts to grow, or if a woman doesn't become pregnant, it signals the period to occur. Now, in order to have a period, does the progesterone have to go away or does it have to be stimulated? A little bit of both. A little bit of both. It's a pattern. The pattern of the estrogen and progesterone releases is what stimulates a normal monthly cycle.